Wu Gang. Welcome to Lauren's Palace. My name is Lauren. I'm also Wu Gang. So let's see what's coming towards us, y'all. I have a feeling a lot of us are going to have a fantastic month. Yeah. It's going to be good. Please like, share, subscribe. Hit your notification button. If you'd like to donate, you can do that as well. I'm going to use some lover's path today. We're going to see what is in store for the book game. Straightforward reads. I know it's been a while. They're waiting for the energies to change because it felt like I was doing the same readings over and over. It's repetitive. Telling the same damn story about the same motherfucker that was doing whatever it is they was doing. You sad, trying to get over shit. You know, same old story. Fine, wants us new, new. That new, new. I don't care if it's retrograde, y'all. When you cosmically aware of what is happening, shit does not affect you. I'm telling you. It's all about your awareness. So let's see what comes out. Thank you, Spirit. Give me accurate, precise messages for my bull gang, my Tauruses. We give thanks and gratitude for the message. Mm. <laughs> Yikes. <laughs> ah. This is looking good, y'all. This is looking real good. Mm. Somebody, though. Ten of staves. This is the ten of wands. This is the... I'm releasing these burdens. I'm just letting all of this bullshit go. Bravo, Taurus. You said I'm done with all of the bullshit. If it's not serving my highest good, it is a wrap for me. That's what's up, bull gang. The person that you've released doesn't feel this way, though. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this person. They're upset. They're upset. I don't know why. Let's, pull, let's read these cards. I'm going to tell you what's up. So, in this deck, Prince is the knight. So, Prince of Arrows. This is some fast incoming communication with Cupid. New lover, new romantic person that stirred your interest. Is that what's going on? Got Cupid, Prince of Arrows. You know, Cupid likes to shoot an arrow, somebody, the crack of somebody ass. Cupid be like, you know. You don't even know what happened. You just, ah, oh, shit.
But someone, a lot of you have been mainly focused on your money. And the money is starting to look really good for you with this Ten of Coins. Whoever it was that you were dealing with seems like while you've been focusing on yourself and your money, this person has somehow awakened to the decisions that they've made regarding you. They've awakened to how they juggled you. It's just two of coins. This is a juggling card. And they had a huge ego. They weren't able to release their ego. And not that they would be triumphant with you with whatever games they were playing. With the six of staves. But guess what's happening? This same person who felt like they won. That felt like they defeated you. That felt like they didn't care about your feelings. This same person. Guess what they're doing? This motherfucker's crying at night. Sad tears. Into the pillow. It's so sad. Crying and drinking, smoking as much herb as they possibly can to try to get over how they felt like they could do whatever they want and they would win. But instead, they're the one left in tears. Because all they've done was force you to figure out how to nurture yourself with this Knight of Coins. You became single. You nurtured yourself. You've been rebuilding, working on your wealth, your money, your abundance, your opportunities. Some of you said, I'm giving relationships a, a hold. I'm going to work on myself. This is what you did. You worked on yourself. So now that you've worked on yourself, guess what's coming in? the Hierophant card. This is us. This is tradition. This is a relationship. This is a partnership. This is a spiritual connection. You have a strong spiritual connection headed your way. Mm. Could be with the earth sign. Could be with the water sign. But there's a start of something new with the princes of coins. Someone's coming to you with the stable new beginning. This is a stable new beginning. This princess. Oh, she's fine too. Where you may be answered. Take it how it resonates. Hmm. I, but this old person, now they're starting to awaken to the pain that they caused you. Or maybe this is someone that you divorced. Could be a couple of different scenarios. So for some of you, this is someone that you divorced and they want to apologize because now they realize how they hurt you. It's eight of arrows, 10 of arrows. This is the most pain you could cause anyone. 
Also, this person may just be plain hurt that you're moving on. This Queen of Cups. Highly intuitive, psychic intuitive queen. Could also be Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. This person is in the Ten of Swords because you're not fucking with them anymore. You've got new coming in. Enjoy yourself. Let's see what the Kipper got to say. Love this shit. This is fantastic. Old person in tears because you done just went and glowed up. <laughs> this person that's coming in may be a wealthy man. I mean, we got 10 of coins here. The, uh, you may hear something from your old person. They might want to tell you that they're sick. They're going through some sort of illness. Gift. Expect a gift. It's your birthday. It's your birthday season. Like, what more gift of that? It's your birthday. Great fortune comes out again. Yo, we getting this money, boo, gang. We gonna get this money. So, and whoever left us out in the cold. Mm. Some of you have a court case that you're dealing with. You're going to win your case. You're going to be successful. Some of you used to live in poverty. You're used to not having enough. But they're saying, you're going to be a wealthy man. Whoever you're dealing with was, is in bad health. You're going to receive the gift of great fortune. <laughs> Wealthy man, gift, great fortune. This might have to do with something in the court system because we have courthouse and then we have adjudication. So whatever this case is that you're in court for, you're going to win this case and you're going to win a lot of money. Um, I'm hearing class action for some of you. So some of you may be involved with some sort of uh, class action lawsuit. Some of you are actually meeting someone that's going to um, show you how to increase your wealth. Um, someone that you're going to build with. But you're going to have, you got a traditional relationship that's on the way. And that's because you've been working on yourself. You've been taking on the time to get aligned with your purpose. This is what is allowing these good things to come in for you. So continue to do this. So these good things will continue to come in. I, I mean... Money, love, the old person is crying and jacking. Stay proud. Their karma is not your problem. You don't want to celebrate them feeling bad or none of that shit. Just realize at this point, their karma is no longer your problem. Yeah, you focus on you. You got too much to do. You got too much work to do for the divine, too much work to do for yourself, and the enjoyment of a beautiful love that's coming your way. Ew. I'm loving these reads today. <laughs> Look at this. Retrograde and we ain't even talking about old shit coming. This is new. Let them cry their tears. Peace, blessings, and I say. Like, share, subscribe. If you want to donate, do that. If you want to book, do that. Love y'all.